Hello my little ones, how are you all? Hope you all are very well. So children, today we'll be solving lesson number 13 of your workbook that is Let's Read A. So let's get started. Question number 1. Write the answers to the following questions. Number 1. Why is the girl sad? Answer. The girl is sad because she thinks that nobody loved her. Question number 2. Where does the girl plan to go? Answer. The girl plans to wander in some mountains and forest or live in desert or at the North Pole. Question number 3. Can a little girl go to such faraway places on her own? Answer. No. A little girl cannot go to such faraway places on her own. Question number 2. Write down the plural more than one forms of. Number 1. Wish. Wishes. Family. Families. Child. Children. Igloo. Igloos. Granny. Grannies. Camel. Camels. Question number 3. Write if the following statements are true or false. Number 1. The girl was sitting behind the sofa for 8 hours. Answer. False. Number 2. The girl had an older sister. Answer. False. Number 3. The girl thought she would become a hermit. Answer. True. Number 4. The girl felt that nobody loved her. Answer. True. Open-ended questions. Question number 1. Write one thing each that makes you. Number 1. Said. When someone scolds me. Number 2. Angry. When someone cheats while playing games. Number 3. Happy. When I get my favorite toy. Question number 2. What do you feel when you are angry? Sad, happy, write down your thoughts. Number one, angry. When I am angry, I feel upset. Number two, sad. When I am sad, I feel bad and stay quiet. Number three, happy. When I feel happy, I laugh and smile a lot. I even dance or jump with joy. Let's see assignment number two. Question number 1. Write the answers to the following questions. Number 1. Is the girl still sad at the end? Answer. No, she is not. Number 2. Does the girl love her little sister? Answer. Yes, she does. Question number 2. In the puzzle given here, find and circle 6 words from the lesson. So here we have bear, hermit, igloo, camel, forest and mountain. Our next question is activity project. Draw a picture of the people who make up your family. So we have our dad, mom, brother, sisters in our family. So you can draw the picture and color it as well. Let's see the last question. Question number two. If you are asked to give a gift to each member of your family, what will you give and why? Write down in a few words. Answer. Gifts can make the giver and receiver feel closer to each other. I would gift a chain with pendant to my mom. I would gift a nice pen to my dad. I would gift a headphones to my brother and a bracelet to my sister. So children, that's all for lesson number 13. Let's wait. Hope you like the video. So if you like the video, do subscribe the channel, like it and share it with your friends who need it. See you soon. Till then, goodbye.